Good combo, GG's. It's me, Mario. Hello, boys and girls, to this wonderful stream, together with my wonderful sister. Hello. Before we even start doing anything, take a look at what I bought. I actually went out of my way and spent a whole life-saving worth of money and bought a Lunar Cloak. I'm now a proud owner of a Lunar Cloak. Look at it. It is actually really, really fancy. Uh, actually, my sister can't even see it since she's not playing on Lunar, but you can see it and it looks absolutely gorgeous. It's only $14.99. I'm not getting paid to say this. In case Lunar Clan wants to pay me money to say this, feel free to do so. You might be wondering why I didn't stream in so long. Okay, nobody probably wonders, but just in case you are, I started an internship. Actually, in Germany, we have some nice little holidays. The longest holidays in all of Germany, they are actually an astonishing six weeks long. Three of these weeks, the first three, I actually have to do an internship. It is not an easy internship. It's at a nursing station. So I have to clean old people, which is uh, actually not even that... Like, you imagine it to be really mentally challenging to do something like this, but it's actually not even that hard. The hardest part about the internship is finally that you have to stand a lot. The one thing that actually gets me so exhausted every single day is that I have to stand so much. If it wasn't for the standing, I would uh, just enjoy the internship and nothing else. But yeah, the problem about it being uh, so physically challenging, since you have to stand all the time, is actually uh, I can't really stream. My back hurts, my legs hurt. Everything hurts, so it's really hard to stream. I wasn't even able to stream Bad Wars, so I just had to stream some SMP. So if you want to see some good Bad Wars content, you probably don't want me to become a nurse. <laughs> Yeah, a really funny story, actually. As you can tell, the internship is pretty challenging. Like, physically, and if you are physically exhausted, obviously, you are not the most awake person anymore. So, basically, I was on my way home, and uh, I was almost back home. And uh, my eyes were partially closed, obviously, since I was so tired. <laughs> I actually, did I mention that? I have to get up at 4.30 in the morning, like 4 a.m. I was pretty tired, and I was pretty done for it. So I didn't really pay much attention anymore. And uh, I was just, I didn't think anything. I, I was just minding my business, walking down the street. And I randomly, just as you do, obviously, you can probably relate to this. From time to time, when you're walking down the street, you just look to the right, look to the left. Nothing special, you know? And uh, this one street, basically pretty close to my uh, door, I was almost home, there is um, a hairdresser, and I was uh, walking right past that, and as I was walking past that, I was just casually looking to the side, looking right towards the store, just as you do from time to time, just looking in random directions. The second I actually uh, looked there, the door opened and someone uh, exited the store, so naturally my eyes wandered up to their face. My brain completely stopped. I have to be honest here, my brain just stopped working since um, that was probably the single most beautiful human being I've ever seen. It was a woman actually, not a man this time. <laughs> My brain couldn't process it. My brain just completely stopped working. Not only my brain stopped, but I actually physically stopped. I just stopped walking and I was standing in front of her and she was just trying to get down the stairs and I was standing right in front of her so she couldn't get down this, <laughs> the stairs. And she was looking at me like, what the freak are you doing? doing? Can I help you? And I was just standing there, my eyes completely, like, only one eye open, and it's not open a lot. And my mouth was probably open. Yeah, I believe my mouth was open. I still remember that. And I'm just looking like the biggest zombie you've ever seen. Completely tired, and I'm just standing there wordlessly looking at this woman. And she was probably scared for her life. And then I realized what I was doing, and I just kept walking without saying a word. It probably would have been less awkward to just say something, but no, I just didn't say anything. I just kept walking. I was like, freak. That was probably one of the cringiest interactions I've ever had with a human in my life. And the moral of the story, uh, I don't know. It's okay to be cringe sometimes as long as you don't hurt the strangers you are cringe towards. Is that a good moral? I guess not. But it was really <laughs> cringe. And again, I don't want to waste my levels, so we're gonna... Eh? What a... Uh, what was that? I will go to Holger. 
Oh yeah, go to Holger. Oh, speaking of Holger, maybe I should show you around a little. First of all, in this house we have uh, good old Steve and obviously Carsten. Then uh, next up, here is our breeding station. This is Holger. Holger, look at me. Yeah, good. I'm not up there. I'm down here. Okay, yeah, Holger. And we also have Svetlana. Basically, up here we have uh, the feeding uh, station. We can just put food in there and they're gonna start to, uh, you know, bees, the birds and the bees, you know how it's going? No. Oh, they're starting. Oh my god, okay. And this is how we got 90% of our villagers. I mean, there's a village nearby. It worked! It worked! Then over here we have good old Fritz. Then we have Emma. Oh, we have Sibylla. And down here we have uh, Beate. <laughs> and over here, in a small box with a boat, is Sabrina. Ah, it's Sabrina, richtig. Good old she Sabrina. Will, she will move in our church. Yeah. This is our new cleric. That's why I'm building this church. Ah, that's why I'm building the church. This is a really quick boy. Unfortunate, bro. We really have to kill him here. Wonderful. The crit. Yellow and gray disconnected? I am going to get two free bets, two finals. We'll actually enter this base to get uh, more blocks and TNT. One, two, three. Oh, that was a really perfect TNT jump. One, two, three. Oh, okay, we did it! That was really good, especially with the two TNT jumps, dude. GG's! Okay, yellow is just uh, self destruction rushing for some reason. You survived that? You can't tell me you survived that. You didn't. Don't have anything to prevent them from doing what they're doing. I don't know what that was, but I got him. Dude, what the heck? We just gifted Pink the win, lol! Also, to explain what happened there, they didn't take any KB since they took a damage tick by jumping down so they could just combo lock me. But uh, I still got him, so we just gifted Pink the win, lol. <laughs> Interesting tasks that I did for the f that I did for the hey they didn't even look at me and hit me that I did for the first time they are not going to have shears so okay they are actually cheating oh I have to play against a cheater again so I'm just I don't want to leave instantly there's always a chance but this person is blatantly cheating. Yeah, they can hit me through blocks. Oh my god. Cheat harder, bro. Cheat harder! No! <laughs> I'm dead. Why are you cheating, man? Why? <laughs> Good combo. GG's. I should have enough time to avoid unless a I will jump up. They don't have shoes. 52-40. Okay, now I can. Alright, and now we only got blue. And last time I saw blue, they were just standing on their bridge, looking kind of confused. Alright, really nice. Another win. That was a good game to end the stream.